Current NBA and former UCLA star Kevin Love is opening up about his struggles with mental health. Love wrote an essay about suffering a panic attack during a game this season. KCAL 9's Lisa Siegel is live in Beverly Hills to show us Love is just the latest NBA player to open up about the subject. Lisa? And he is definitely making an impact along with other players who have shared their stories instead of staying silent. It was November 5th during a game against the Atlanta Hawks when Cleveland Cavalier Kevin Love had a massive panic attack. His first. He said it came out of nowhere. I'd never had one before. I didn't even know if they were real. But it was real, as real as a broken hand or a sprained ankle. In the Players' Tribune, the former UCLA star talks about the perceptions of being a man, not wanting to show weakness, and the moment it all crashed down on him. He said everything was spinning like my brain was trying to climb out of my head. The air felt thick and heavy. My mouth was like chalk. It's so common. So many men and women struggle with so much shame around pursuing mental health services. Psychologist Jenny Tates works with high profile clients from celebrities to athletes and says love is not alone. Lakers Channing Fry recently spoke about his own depression and love credits Toronto Raptors star DeMar DeRozan for inspiring him to speak up. DeRozan, who grew up in Compton and starred at USC, recently opened up about his own battle with depression. It tells others that they're not alone and that they deserve to get help and that help is out there and that this is part of being human and even athletes who are successful and thriving are struggling with their mental health. Players and fans are applauding Love for sharing his story. His teammate LeBron James tweeted this, you're even more powerful now than ever before Kevin Love. Salute and respect brother. And Love tweeted as well, a message to anyone who may be suffering in silence. I thought about mental health as someone else's problem. I realized I need to change that. And Dr. Tate says it is important because we need to realize it is brave to speak out, to ask for help, and of course to show others they are not alone. Back to you.